won't stop. I won't stop. No. I won't stop. I won't stop. No. Hey guys, so welcome to another weekend vlog. I honestly thought that I did a intro, but apparently I didn't, or apparently it wasn't recording. So I just went to the seawall. This is Friday afternoon, and I just went on the seawall for a little bit of fresh breeze. Um, yeah, so this is a seawall. Honestly, I really love the upgrades that they're doing to the seawall lately. Because, I mean, everybody goes to hang out out there. And I just love how they're making it more attractive for, for people to come out. And um, for businesses to be able to come and open um, legally on the seawall. So, I really love that. And it has been very nice seeing all of the improvements on the seawall. And honestly, for a Friday afternoon, I did not expect to see as much people as i saw on the seawall on the seawall so that was very refreshing all right guys so as we were cruising down the seawall we decided to stop at this um hot dog spot this latino hot dog place that normally sells they sell a variety of stuff actually but i just opted for the hot dog um because they're hot dog they sell burgers it's quite filling that's the place look at the hot dog guys Tell me why I had the sweetest tooth and I decided that I was going to make this Hershey marshmallow dip that I've been seeing on um, TikTok. I saw it on YouTube. I think I even saw it on Instagram. So like, it was like all over my feed all weekend. So I went out and bought the marshmallows and the chocolates to put on it. Guys, I it was a total fail because I made my chocolate burn. Such a waste of good chocolate hurt my feelings. I ain't gonna lie. And I got me, I ended up buying Shirley Biscuit to dip. This is me struggling to dip it. Like struggling, really struggling to dip it. I had to stop recording so I can dip it out properly. And when I finally got to dip and I tried it, it was super duper hot it literally burned me it is hot as hell i had to spit it out because ain't nobody got time for that but all in all i will do it again this time i probably will not melt my chocolate because i'm not trying for my chocolate to burn <laughs> they're gonna hurt my feelings again so yeah it was really good so i will definitely try it again it's given smurfs vibes
hey guys good morning and welcome back to the vlog so today i'm gonna show y'all my skincare routine because your girl has been you know my skin has been doing so much better in the last few months i'm gonna share with y'all what i've been doing and how i got rid of the breakouts like the constant breakouts that i've been having a lot the first thing i've been doing is trying to drink as much water as possible i love sweet but i've been trying my best to cut down on drinking so much sweet so I definitely have been drinking a lot of water and I've also been using this CeraVe cleanser and my same moisturizer that I have been using for a really long time and another thing that I've started putting on my pimples is something called Mycogel it's not necessarily something for acne but it's been helping clear this little this stuff on my forehead so I really love that for me I'm gonna Okay guys, so for my skincare routine, on days when I'm doing my, my Aztec clay mask, I like to go in with my Aztec clay mask first. And usually when you're doing this, you need to make sure that you mix it with a plastic spoon and don't use any metals. Um, based on research, it's basically, when you use metal spoons, it take out the properties in the actual clay mask that will actually work for your skin here or whatever wherever you want to put it so yeah all right y'all so this is what <laughs> it's looking like like i could barely move my face so i'm going to wash it off and i'll be back for the next step in my skincare routine so this is what it's looking like So next, I'm just going to go in with this cleanser that I mentioned before. I go in with typically one pump because one pump is enough. And then I like to leave this on for a little while just so that the products can like sink into my skin. Normally I do this when I'm showering and I like to just leave this in, leave this on my face for a little while. And then by the time I finish taking my shower, I just rinse my face and my body and everything together. But for today's video, the purposes of today's video, I'm just going to do it now and just leave it in for a little bit. So next I'm going to go in with this gentle face scrub. I don't do this every day. I do this like probably once or twice a week, but just a little bit like so. And then I just like to scrub my face with this, especially inside my nose. It tends to get a lot of build up. Don't forget your neck. And it kind of has like a minty feeling. I don't know what is that, but it just works for me. And what I'm going to do is just let, leave this in also for a little bit. And then I'm going to rinse it off. Whenever I have active breakouts, I like to go in with this moisturizing, well not active, I also like to moisturize with this when I'm finished, this is almost done. The active breakouts, I like to put this on also, like on my forehead, especially where I know I get those really fine boils. And that's my skincare routine guys also don't forget your lips i've been using this lip scrub take a little bit okay 
I normally put this on the same time when I put on my face girl. And you can find some selling locally if you can't get your hands on this one. Yeah, and this is how your lips look after. And then you just proceed to put it on your favorite lip balm, Vaseline, lip gloss, whatever. And that's my skin scare routine, guys. Now back to the vlog. Alright, so I already have my chicken and my potatoes marinating. I normally like to do this and just leave it overnight. Or I do it like a few minutes before I'm ready to cook and just let it, you know, marinate. The, the chicken was already seasoned, so I just put in the potato, the curry, and everything else. So here we have curry, make some salad, jira. It already has salt, black pepper, all the other peppers, and it's just like sitting there together. Also grind seasoning, because you know, you can't forget that. And now I'm going to cook my curry. Add in my oil, just a little bit, right? I don't cook with a lot of oil because I don't even. This is where I'm just literally going to. Now my curry kind of fried up. Um, my potatoes and curry to fry. And now I'm gonna cover the pot. I just cover the pot and let it do its thing. Okay, right, guys, so this is the curry that's all cooking down in, so in its own juices. I forgot to tell y'all that I turned it on the stove and just let it work. And I'm just gonna stir it up. Okay, so it's already getting nice and nice and soft um because i'm eating this with rice i'm gonna add a little bit of water this is what it's looking like when i add the water and i'm also gonna add some more salt to taste curry is all done nice. curry purple my own back hey guys so I'm going to end today's vlog here um, I just filmed this hairstyle it's just something really quick and simple i'm gonna put it into a short so yeah i'm gonna put it into a short and i'm gonna edit it so look out for that um i noticed that you guys really enjoyed my sheen haul so i'm definitely gonna do another one but yeah guys um don't forget to like share comment and subscribe and of course i'm gonna catch you guys in the next video bye guys